is up you guys today we're back and today this is about my fifth take of this out intro so we're gonna get this rolling first video you're gonna see clips are me catching a pike and a failed MTV challenge video smallest jig in the box caught the biggest fish of all day because we only really caught one and my friend Logan caught some dink perch but I didn't feel like putting those in the video two Second video is a lake close to my house. I went to it multiple times. No one was really catching anything. The crappie bite in the summertime was actually really good. I caught like six 14-inch crappies in like a half an hour. Then I left, but I didn't film that day. It was just me and my buddy going out, mess around, and used minnows. Actually, it was surprising. I used live bait for once. And third video is going to be, or the third video that you're going to see. It wasn't really a video. It was just to make this video longer. This is kind of just an update, or every video that I filmed where I caught a fish, but it wasn't like a full video where I only caught one or two fish, I put in this video. And the fourth video is where me and my buddy fished this pond that we never see anyone fish, and it's kind of just off the side of the road, I was going to do a Google, Ma Google Maps challenge, Google Earth challenge, or whatever you want to call it. But we snuck onto this pond, ice fishing, and it was like maybe two inches of ice, probably not even that, it was slushy ice, I could just like scrape through it with my foot and I dropped down a little frostbite tantrum caught a little sunfish hybrid type thing then we left I actually fished that pond today I saw some more sunfish but it this is already gone here Michigan I filmed these clips a week ago literally most of these are the last clip where we snuck onto the pond snuck onto the pond I filmed these clips a week ago today it was already 63 so spring fishing is a go you will see a few videos filmed in my old boat that I had last year. It's just an old 14 foot boat. I'll do a rundown on that boat because I'm not getting rid of it. Hint, hint, I may or may not be getting a new boat. I don't know what it is yet, but I'm definitely getting one. So stay tuned for that. Stick with it. Stay tuned. You won't be pissed this time because I actually catch more than one fish. And enjoy the video. We're on. We're on. What the hot? I don't know what it is. Something dogging. It's got some decent head shakes to her. Oh, shoot. <laughs> is, it, is it eating yours? Uh-uh. Dude, because it is ripping on mine, bro. Oh, it's a pike. It's a pike. Is it it's actually? a giant pike. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. It's a giant pike. Not even going to lie. We're tightening down that drag. Get over here, boy. Come in here, big boy. Oh, it's a pike. It's a good pike. <laughs> is it really? Yes. Let's go. What the... It ate that tiny jig, bro. Alright. This is fish number one. Good little Mr. Pike here. Caught it on the, uh... I don't even know what this is. I'll get you the name of it, but that is... The little jig. I don't know if you can see it. I'll put it in the video later. But, back down the hole he goes. Or should we get a measurement? Let's get a measurement. There's enough water in the bottom of this. Okay. This slime coating is not coming up. That's why I love fish grippers, dude. They're so nice. This is a 24-inch scale. What'd you say, 23? Yeah, 23. 23-inch pike on a little jig and a 25-inch rod. That was a fun fight. Not a bad fish. Let's get them back down the hole. Undo that fish grippers. Get that thing out of the way. Put them back down the hole. There he goes. He's getting the snacks. The coyote's got the rest of the Here snacks. Oh, shoot. He's throwing Red Bulls at me. I caught it, though. The fishing pack. Oh, yeah. Well, now we got the video title if we don't catch any fish. Dead animal. Caught on live camera. Fucking dead in the tracks, bud. Oh, yeah. Dead. Coyote tracks everywhere. Coyote hunting coming next week. Ten likes, and I'll go find the den. <laughs> so. Alright, first one of the day wasn't recording. You know, not catching many, but oh, just. Bloop. Nice little bluegill. Yay. They are. Fucking marking them up. Down out. there. How many fish we can't catch here? Let's drop down a little bit more. Some of these fish might be a little finicky. I don't have live bait on because last time I didn't use live bait. 
and they were just slaying the plastic, but this time I might put on live bait. So yeah, let's see how many fish I can't catch before the sun goes down. Right now I'm not off to a very good start, so let's try and work some out of those weeds. He's coming up to it, he's coming up to it, he's coming up to it. Jig it. They're right on it, why aren't they biting it? I did bring wax worms, I just bought them. I got them. Light bite, didn't even feel it. Don't wrap yourself in the transducer. Beautiful little hybrid. All right, the video you saw before this was here. I wanted to put the update video and that nice massive uh, pike catch I caught, or pike I caught in a video and all that. And the other fish, two fish I caught up a lake near me. But anyway, beautiful hybrid, a little bit of sunset. And it's about to be a, if we can't jig something up. And right as I say that, I can't see my own screen. I think here something comes. Let's jig it again. This is such a light bite. It's almost impossible. Cause there's a bunch of tiny gills. And you know when those go away, that it's just pure bass out here. Sorry, I took my sweatshirt strings away. That was, in the, look at that, I even, I even noticed that bass was there that hybrid was there oh come on get untangled come on unwrap yourself there you go put the thing back in the hole got another one you can't stop slaying them yep we're actually gonna move over there in a little bit there goes a little another hybrid we're actually gonna jig it again here they come oh they're coming in hot Oh, they're coming in hot. Wait for your line to straighten out. And you got them. That's so small. That is so small. That is the tiniest bass I've ever caught. That is the smallest bass I've ever caught. If I had a fish tank, my jig made a better blip than this. My jig made a bigger blimp than this on the radar. But look at that guy. He's really cute. But he just said, hey, kid. Gary, he's yelling at you, come on. He's yelling at you, don't you hear him? He's yelling at you. Don't you hear, is he, do you see someone? Garrett, do you see anybody? I heard someone yell. I thought he said, hey, kid. Either I just got bit or... Oh, it's the UPS guy, dude. I'm, I'm kind of sketched out. <laughs> Gary just went in. Gary just went in, and I missed it. No, no, Gary just. Gary, you good? Did your feet get wet? Oh God. Gary just went down, and I missed it. I missed it. I totally did miss it. It's all my fault. It is all my fault. I did miss it. We're sitting on about an inch of ice. Oh, what was that? Oh my gosh, we're on, we're on, we're on. No way, no way, gear it, gear it. Gear, I caught a fish. There's no way, there's no way, there's no way. Random pond on the side of the road. Did I just catch a bluegill on a rattle bait? No way. I just caught the world's, my recording? Yes, I just caught the world's tiniest sunfish. No way. They're here, I'm getting the teardrop out. That guy can't even fit back down the hole. There's fish. It's confirmed. We are coming back in like three days here.